Calhoun Middle and Cowan High School, welcome to PBIS Rewards. We are excited to share this program with you. I know that you've got your login information or are working on logging in, but we have some great, exciting things to show you today. Again, you'll log in using your ccsjackets.org email, unless you're one of a few folks like myself that were a calhounschools.org login, but for most of you, it's your ccsjackets.org login, um, and you'll go to the PBIS Rewards staff login. We'll also add the link to the home um, school websites too. Once you're signed in, you're going to go ahead, and I know some of you have multiple schools, and we'll get to the bottom of that later as far as um, helping you navigate that. But I'm going to start off in Calhoun Middle School. Most of you are assigned to one school. And when you go in, it's going to bring you straight to your PBIS Rewards reward student option. Super simple. You're going to type in the name of a student. It can be any student on our roster at Calhoun Middle School and for high school at Calhoun High School. If I typed in... McClarty, Jaquan McClarty, 8th grade. I can reward points here based on any one of the items below. This uh, coincides with our PRIDE acronym. So if he showed great integrity today by turning in money that may not have belonged to him, I'm going to go ahead and reward a point in integrity. I want to make sure I put a comment, turned in money, or anything else that I want to put in there. It is optional, but it certainly helps to document. And I'm going to go ahead and reward that point. When I've rewarded the point, you'll see that it's going to show up here how many total points I've awarded today. So I gave out three points today so far. He was one of my three. It also has a point goal that we can use, but we may or may not. Again, I can give to any student on our roster for Calhoun Middle School. Christopher Smith, same thing, dependability, reward. You only want to use... Um, one of these items per stinger. So if you're giving out multiple stingers for one student, great. You can click on multiple areas, but if you're just giving out one stinger, just pick one area because each click equals one point or one stinger. Now, when going to groups, Calhoun Middle School has your synced group set up. Calhoun High School is in process. If I wanted to search for Miss Cindy Fudge, I can pull up all of her groupings right here that show me who are in her classes. So if I'm saying, you know what, my entire homeroom demonstrated purpose today and they deserve a stinger, I'm going to go click on my homeroom here with Cindy Fudge. I can select all students. I can select just some students. I can select whoever I want in here, select the item, include a comment, and reward points. Okay? and you're good to go. Again, great, easy, super useful to add points. Play around with us, have fun. If you're looking just to know how to add points, you're all finished. If you're looking to um, learn a little more about our program, I'll share a few more points. One thing, you'll be able to see your activity and track it as it is entered. You'll be able to go to a store, and Ms. Hope Stevenson in video number two is going to be showing you how to set up your Stinger menu so students can purchase items in your class stores and in the overall school store. We're going to set up events that can be used to redeem stingers for events such as our dining out options, a really easy way to document. If we were having a movie in the CPAC as a reward, we can have students trade in and turn in their stingers here too electronically. We can do raffles here for gift cards and so forth. We're working on our referral system that will be used um, potentially to document some of our student behaviors in the classroom. We can send announcements. We can issue teacher awards. Guys, we're going to be having rewards coming your way in an effective and easy way to support and demonstrate. Um, we can pull reports so that we can see exactly what's going on in our classrooms um, in relation to how we're issuing rewards. We can pull our students, look at our staffs, and then finally, we're going to be issuing ID badges that will go on each student's Chromebook that will have a first and last name. Woohoo, I know we wanted that on our Chromebooks with their grade level, and a QR scan code that will link directly to their PBIS Rewards account. I'm also going to see if technology can act put an app on the home screen of our students so they can access it easily from their perspective. We're rolling this out this week with teachers to get familiar, next week with students. So please don't start out issuing stingers quite yet. We're not quite there, but we will be next week, and we'll let you know as soon as we're ready to get the ball rolling. But we're excited. Thank you for tuning in. Please make sure to set up your stinger menu by watching the video that Hope Stevenson's provided. Go Jackets. Have a great day.